what is up you guys thank you so much for being a part of my channel i really and truly appreciate each and every one of you don't forget to like the video share and subscribe to the channel if you would like more exclusive content follow us on to patreon i have also opened the memberships back up so you have access to the extended videos uh, as well as being able to book personals with me. Don't forget, all that is listed in the description box. What is up, you guys? Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. I really and truly appreciate each and every one of you. We're going to go ahead and jump straight into what you need to know in this time, what you need to be aware of, and what you can expect, okay? We're going to go with whatever comes out, regardless if it's that situation that I don't want to talk about. I'm going to talk about it, okay? Whatever. Oh, my God, you got to be kidding me. Okay, <laughs> I don't want to. Okay, so I'm really thinking about stopping this video and starting over again, but I just said I'm I'm going to talk about, okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. Okay. All right, I'm going to pull a few cards before I even get into the message because I'm already annoyed. I'm already annoyed. And the fact that I'm already annoyed, you probably are too. Let's just see what else will come out before I even get into it. Because the one topic that I said I am not, I don't want to talk about. <laughs> okay, so we've got, will you marry me? We've got spiritual warfare. We've got magic. <sighs> Y'all, what you need to know in this time is there is somebody wanting to serenade you. Somebody wants to serenade you. Um, this is either someone who you have a child with or somebody here who has a child. And I cannot say that they don't. And I can't say I'm, I'm full of shit because you see this is a completely different deck. And this is what's on the bottom of the deck. Okay? This is what's on the bottom of the deck. This is exactly what I didn't want to talk about, but it came out yet again. So, uh, I guess they're forcing me into a message about this uh, today for you guys, alright? So, if you don't want to hear it, just click off the video. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't work around it, alright? And because it came out, I feel like I am going to pull from the Dark Mirror um, deck as well for this reading. Because this is getting about ridiculous, okay? Um, especially with that spiritual warfare here. I feel like for some of you, you are either about to go through a test with a co-parent... Or you're into the thick of it. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> that song started playing. Into the thick of it. Okay. Um, for some of you, it's like... It, I can see you wanting to release yourself from a situation. And I feel like if you are to fight fire with fire in this time, you may have a harder time releasing yourself from the situation but i feel like there's something about you may need to fight somebody with facts okay um i but I, when i was sitting there saying something about serenading you i feel like for some of you if you have decided to move on from a co-parent or someone who you have a child with if you have decided uh to move on with your life maybe move in with a love interest or to move off with a love interest or to invest in your money into them in any way or your time into them in any way um you are about to experience uh a lot of <laughs> i heard fragonacle bullshit some some mess okay you're about to experience some mess in this time with somebody here who feels like if you're going to offer anything to anybody, it should be to me. Okay. Okay. So, there's definitely somebody who has caught your interest. All right. And there is like a bitter baby mama, baby daddy who is feeling some type of way about this. They're about to try to stir up some kind of emotions in you uh, to make you feel it. Okay. I feel like I'm seeing somebody over here trying to flip this boat over. All right. Specifically with this water being choppy back here and the water that you're trying to move on to being smooth. Okay. You may be trying to move yourself out of a situation and continue to keep your eyes on the prize or keep yourself focused on forward movement. I feel like there's somebody coming in in this next little while trying to tip the boat or rock the boat okay rock the boat so 
Um, for those of you who may have more than one love interest, there is definitely about to be some mess go on in this time. And I feel like you are about to have to kind of slay some kind of beast. And it's like addressing something head on. Possibly something that you would have chosen to turn the other cheek on or look the other way. I feel like they're saying um, not to fight fire with fire, but to fight fire with facts. <laughs> okay you may be forced to fight fire with facts in this next little while okay i feel like there's somebody here who is not over the connection they're not over you they're not over the connection and they are trying to make something happen but what i do see is you have luck on your side in this time uh for those of you who understand the difference between spirituality spirituality gee, okay spirituality versus uh religious things like i feel like you are not allowing somebody to um make you feel like you are being like, if you go a different way, it's against, oh, it's against your religion. It's against the Bible. It's against some kind of set structure, okay? I feel like somebody may be trying to make you feel this way or that people are talking about you in this way if you go a different route, okay? I feel like there is somebody who is trying to get in your head. Um, with this, the temple of my body, this is kind of giving temptation type energy coming off of this. And we've got obsession. There's somebody here who cannot see anything other than, you know, one way to be, one way of handling this. And this person is about to try to sink their claws into you. Because we've got magic out here, somebody, either you or them, is practicing in this time of ways to get something to go in their favor to rock the boat. They are doing something in order to kind of... Get you to take your eyes off of your target or take your eyes off of the direction that you're moving in this time, okay? The temple of my body, okay? I feel like this person um, definitely fantasizes about you often. Look at this. Somebody is wanting to offer you something, but it's like I feel like the offer that may be coming in from this person, you need to be aware it's a trick. There's somebody here who is sending some kind of offer to you as a trick, all right? Um, this is kind of also giving don't sell your soul for this position. This is like fated to suffer. There's somebody here who feels like if I can't have you, no one can. And if I can't have you, I'm going to make your life hell. Okay. So I feel like if this person is coming around you in this time, they haven't spoken to you, um, as a, like, I feel like it's either they haven't spoken to you or they don't give you the right kind of attention. Okay. I feel like they're about to be trying to come around to you to see if you will take whatever they are trying to offer you. Um, taking something at face value. I feel like you need to be very careful. Um, there is a motive or an agenda behind what this person is coming in and what this person is offering. Um, I feel like it's real low down. I feel like you would you would be very pissed off uh, to know the true motivation behind this. It's like I don't even have to ask what the motivation is. It, it's it's fucked up. Okay. I feel like there is somebody here who is watching you move on with your life. Okay. They may be trying to tip something over. Okay. Uh, tip you off. So there may be somebody here who is coming in to kind of give you some kind of information to either tip you off or to get you kind of emotionally distraught over someone who you may be interested in as of right now. I feel like when this comes in, you're going to be pissed off. Okay. They could be trying to, um, set your love interest up as well in this time to get them to do something that you would deem as, untrustworthy unloyal if you're already in a partnership with another individual you've got somebody on the outside who is about to come in and try to make you feel like what you've got with another person 
isn't anything. I feel like for some of you, I'm telling you this so that you have the ability to protect your current partnership or current love interest, like what's going on between you. Because I feel there's somebody on the outskirts who is basically nuts. Ain't that funny? <laughs> Squirrel, they're nuts. All right. They are coming in at like a fire breathing dragon. All right. It could be with their words. But it's definitely looking like they are coming in trying to turn over any, like any kind of progress you may have made with another person. They're coming in to try to get you to move on from that or to be upset at that individual. Okay. I wouldn't even, like, I feel like this person may actually kind of pay, like, they would pay for somebody to come in and wreak havoc in you and your person's life or you and your love interest partnership, okay? For some of you, this person has already paid for certain things to happen, okay, to keep you stuck or to keep you from being able to get to the next level. For some of you, you may have, you. this could, even, I could be talking about your fiance or something of that nature, okay? They feel like you're only with this person for, for looks or for views or for attention. They're about to come in and test how strong y'all's connection is, okay? They're going to see, you know, if you can withstand... I heard treachery, so for some of y'all gonna feel y'all gonna feel some type of way about this, but you need to know that you are your partnership is under attack in this time. And because I did pull the spiritual card, you do need to know. And this is really funny. I feel like children has been has been coming out constantly. Has it not? Like in the daily reads, you keep pulling children. Do you see it's trying to peek out right here? Do you see it? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Um so, for some of you, if it's not a specific love interest that's coming in trying to cause havoc in your relationship or whoever you're interested in, this could be a child over here giving certain tidbits of information to see if it can get you upset or to respond in an aggressive way, okay? But I, I really feel like it's a co-parenting situation, like a co-parenting one where you're dealing with like outside, like having to go back and forth. Okay. Maybe this is an add on to that. Okay. Let me see if they'll tell me when this is about to happen because I feel like they're trying to prepare you to get you ready for this. Righty tighty Scorpio <laughs> co-parenting again and frenemy. Okay. Somebody is definitely on the prowl in this time to get you to question the person of interest, somebody who you're interested in, okay? I feel like for some of you, I may be talking in past tense. For others of you, this could be something that you're dealing with right now. Mm -hmm.